Hey guys, I'm back. I'm um, gonna start chapter three, bridge deck. Um, sorry, uh, I didn't record anything this past weekend. I was just really busy and tired, and I wasn't feeling well, so yeah, I wasn't really in the mood to record. So, um, hopefully I'll get two videos out of this uh, recording session. So, uh, yeah, I believe there's gonna be a cutscene. Wait. An assault bomber? When Jill said Wesker was planning to spread Uruboros throughout the world. He's planning to use this to spread it. Wesker! There he is! Come on, let's go! Jill! Are you alright? I'm fine. Don't worry about me. Just listen carefully. There's something I need to tell you. Wesker's superhuman strength. It comes from a virus. But the virus is unstable. In order to maintain a balance, he must inject himself regularly with a serum. So if he cut the supply of serum, he loses his strength? Affirmative. But he just took a dose, so it's going to be a while before he needs another one. Listen, Excella said that the amount administered has to be precise. So if he injects too much, it should act like a poison. I think she used the serum label PG-678W. PG-678W? I'm gonna try to find a way to escape. You need to find that serum. Excella always kept it with her, and in that how she came. Jill! Come in! Jill! Shit. Chris. This is it. Let's give it a shot. Okay, so basically we're gonna have to get that serum, and I believe we're supposed to inject uh, Wesker with that so that, um, yeah, it'll weaken him or something like that. Anyways... I know that there's like a little Easter egg here. Um, I think I have to wait for them to stop talking. To stop talking, I want to check out the Easter egg. Okay. Yeah. Uh, no. No. Okay. Maybe I have to turn around. Um. Yeah. Okay. So yeah, you could take a seat here, and uh, yeah. <laughs> fun little easter egg and um you could also have your partner um take a seat as well <laughs> Shev is looking really pensive all right well that's all the fun we're gonna have for now so let's uh take the lift and uh Go on to this next part, which is super not fun. Yeah, so basically we need to get to those doors, which is really fucking far away. And I don't know why they had to have the ca camera spin around, but they did. Maybe they wanted to make it look cool, but whatever. Alright, so... Uh, there's a Magini here. You could wait for him to get blown out by the fire. Yeah, see? He gets killed. Yay! Just try not to get hit by the fire yourself, because that's not good. Um, Jump down here. There's going to be another Magini down there. Yeah, he's to my right. Yeah. I'm going to take him out. Yeah, I think he's dead. You're not gonna give me anything? Fine, asshole. Okay. There's plenty to go around. Oh, money. Yay. Okay. Let's head up here. And, uh, let's shoot this dick bag. Anyways, um, we have to pull a lever to open, um, the first door so we could get to those other doors. And there's gonna be a lot of obstacles in the way and it's gonna suck ass. Okay, pull the lever. And as you can see, the tricell door is opening very, 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 very slowly. 
I don't know why it has to open so slowly, but it does. So you're gonna have to sit tight for a little while. Okay. Take these assholes out. And they like to jump down um, from the higher platforms, so just watch out. Oh. Oh, whoa. Shava just shot him, so he's dead. Punch him! Okay, Shava, do your thing. Break his neck. Watch out, Shava, jeez. Ooh, Magnum ammo. Come on, pick it up! Okay. Hey, you pick this up too. Okay, I'm just kind of waiting for that door to open. So, um... Just try not to get hit by the um, Magini with the stun rods, because I'm... It's really, really annoying, so... Um... Pick this up. Yeah, pick up whatever ammo's lying around. Pick this guy out. Watch out, there's a bunch of Magini with uh, machine guns too, so... Make sure you don't get shot. Yeah, this part um, might be nice to have a, a sniper rifle on you. Just so that you don't have to be like right next to them to kill them. Oh man, there's an RPG man too, so be careful of that. I forgot that some of these guys had RPGs. Will you fucking stay still, please? Just die! Take it, Shava. Jeez. Okay. I know there's more guys around. They're just hiding. Where are they? I don't- cause I- I don't wanna just run out there and get like... Beat the shit out of- okay, there's someone who's an RPG. I see this fucker is hiding. Get out here right now! You guys are shitheads. Uh, where is that? Okay, I think that's the guy with the RPG, yeah. Yeah, because there's been plenty of times that I've played this chapter and I just go running out there and I get like... I get my ass handed to me by getting, like, bombarded with RPGs, so, um, yeah. Just running out there is not the best plan. So I'm just kind of waiting for these guys to come out so I could shoot them. Okay, come on, person. Where are you going? Where Where is he going? I don't understand. There's another dude. What are you- <laughs> what is he shooting at? I don't understand. I swear to God, he looked like he was shooting the ceiling. Oh shit, oh shit. Oh man. You guys suck! Yeah, that's a good place to take cover. Another dude. Yeah, so I mean, pick up whatever you can. My inventory is getting kind of full, so. Yeah. 
I do want to make some room for some other things. That's why I'm not picking up the shotgun shells. I will take this though, because you could sell those um, necklaces. Okay, anything down here? Just kind of scoping out the area. Jump over here. Doesn't really look like it. I mean, there's a few herbs floating around, so I mean, if you're running low in health, make sure you pick those up. Um, because I know there's some green herbs around. Yeah, like right there. And uh, there might, I think there might be also some uh, red herbs hanging around. Uh, I'm not exactly sure where. It might be in one of these uh, rooms, actually. Oh yeah, here's a red herb, which is useful. And nitrogen rounds if you have a grenade launcher. Uh, I don't have my grenade launcher, so I'm not going to pick up the nitrogen rounds. And I don't have room anyways. And there should be some goodies in here. Yeah, there's a first aid spray and uh, some proximity bombs. Um, I'm going to exchange that. Um, I'm going to use this. And... Uh, no, Sheva, I don't want it. Oh, You're such a shit. Okay. I want this. And I'm gonna have Sheva pick up this since she decided to pick up the other proximity bomb. And they're useful, but I'm not gonna be using it in this area, so whatever. Anyways, um... Ooh, necklace. Could sell that. I think... That's all the Magini in this area. I don't. I haven't seen any for a while. So um, yeah. Uh, pull this lever, and just to warn you though, uh, after you pull this lever, a couple um, what are the, uh, a couple Reapers are gonna pop out. So uh, just be careful, cause there's gonna be two Reapers, and I fucking hate Reapers. So, oh yeah, there there's one. There's another one too, um, yeah. I want to make sure they're right next to each other so I can fucking shoot them with my RPG and just like kill both of them at the same time. Let's see. Oh, there's the other one, yeah. <laughs> Try not to get grabbed by them. All right, where are you guys? Okay, okay, they're right next to each other. Yeah, and Sheva was just in the way, it's okay. I'll heal her stupid ass. Whatever. Yay! Gems and shit. Okay. Oh shit, the battery for my controller is low. I gotta plug that shit in. Hold on. Alright. We're good to go. I plug my uh, controller in. Okay, so once this gate comes up, uh, two JJs are gonna spawn and it's gonna suck ass. So, um, I don't know. Actually, I should have probably given an RPG to Sheva also, so I could have used an RPG on the Reapers and then another RPG to kill both of the JJs. But I guess I didn't plan well enough, but it's okay, it should be fine. Uh, I believe the red JJ is stronger than the normal one, so watch out. Ah, oh, shit! You fucker! I'm gonna fucking kill you! Oh my god. Stop shooting the wall! Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my god! Go away! Okay, my shotgun's not doing anything. God damn it! Let me get away! Okay, this isn't working out. Okay, we gotta go. We gotta go. Let's go. Let's go. Okay, the thing is, uh, we need to kill those JJs. We need to kill both of them because they have key cards um, that we need to get to the next part. So, um, yes, first aid spray. Give me. Okay, I'm just gonna run away for a little bit and collect healing items. Oh my god, go away! Okay. You can go back this way. Die, fucker. 
Yeah, I'm not I'm not doing a great job here. Sorry guys. Um yeah, so like I was saying earlier, it might be a good idea to make sure you, uh, you have an RPG and Sheva has an RPG because you could take out the Reapers with the first RPG and then when you want to take out the JJs, just ask Sheva to give you the RPG and then you could use that on them because unfortunately, you cannot carry two RPGs at the same time, which I think is kind of bullshit, but whatever. Okay, get the fuck out of my way. Yay, money. Okay, I'm just gonna be collecting stuff. Ooh. No, stop hurting me. Come on. Okay, I believe there's a turret up here. Yes, there is. Okay, there's a turret. Um, you could use that on the JJs. Or other enemies. Where are they? Oh. Go away. Well, that's just fucking fair. They're like shooting from a angle that I can't even see them. Oh my god! Fuck you guys! Fuck both of you! Just die! Uh, fuck, okay. She is dying. And both JJs are here. I wish you just d both died right now. This is really frustrating. <laughs> you guys are fuckers! Okay. Yay, I got a trophy. Whatever. Okay, I think Red JJ's dead. Die, motherfucker! Kick the shit out of you. Okay, finally, they're both fucking dead. Sorry, that was really frustrating. Usually it's easier for me because I usually have an RPG just to use on them, but I didn't plan wisely. What are you doing, Sheva? We don't need to use a turret anymore. All right, so, um, flash grenades. Uh, flash grenades aren't gonna be very useful after this point which is fine but I mean I'll just keep it in my inventory I right, just combine these yeah okay whatever all right so that's it we got both key cards and we can proceed to the next area Yeah, and there's gonna be a long cutscene after we go through these doors. 